What a beautiful tune! Keep an eye on that chest. Which tweeny is that? Wait until you see two cards the same. Which one of these looks different? Remember which order the musical notes are played in. You've got to get three in a row. Don't let the shields be placed three in a row. Match the baby dragon to the big one. Press the correct button quickly to catch him. Hang the gong as quickly as you can to wake the dragon. Press the cross button to jump. Press the correct button to make the tweeny jump. Press the cross button when you're about to hit the bed to get higher. Now, move up and down to avoid the bats. Pick a door. Press the cross button when you want to make a selection. Good luck. Keep trying. You're doing well. You can do it. Have another go. Well done. You've won a prize. That's it. You've collected all of your costume. Well done. Now then, you have to remember which chest the prize dropped in. Keep an eye on it as it moves, then use the directional buttons to select the right one, followed by the cross button to make your choice. Match the coloured tweeny picture to the silhouette using the directional buttons. Then, press the cross button to make your choice. All you have to do is press the cross button as quickly as you can when two matching cards appear. Now, the idea of this game is to spot which one of the knights is a different colour from the rest. Use the directional buttons to select the right one, followed by the cross button to make your choice. You must copy the tune played to you by remembering and repeating the controller button sequence. Just like knots and crosses, you must get three swords in a row. Move the highlight around with the directional buttons and press the cross button to make your selection. OK, all you've got to do here is match the colour of the baby dragon with the big dragon. Use the directional buttons to select the right one, followed by the cross button to make your choice. You must catch the spider by pressing the controller button that the spider is sitting on. You must be quick though, or it'll run off. To get through the door, you must wake the dragon. Now do this by pressing the cross button as quickly as possible until the music note bursts. You must jump across the water using the stones by pressing the cross button. Watch out for the middle stone, though. You can't step on it when it's underwater. You must jump across the water using the stones. Press the controller button that appears on the next stone as soon as you see it. To make the tweeny jump high enough to clear the hole in the floor, press the cross button just as the tweeny is about to land back onto the bed. Oh, and doodles will also shout when the button needs to be pressed. In this game, you must dodge the bats that fly towards you. Move using the directional buttons. When you've dodged them all, you can continue with your adventure. Simply pick an exit door by selecting the matching controller button. Crash into the obstacles, you'll lose an instrument. Use the directional buttons to steer the spacecraft. Try to avoid those obstacles. The clock in the corner of the screen tells you how much time you have. Remember, you've only got a set amount of time to get all the instruments. Space Race Tweenies! The aim of this game is to fill the empty boxes seen at the top of the screen with instruments. These instruments will make up a whole tune. Now then, to collect the instruments, use the directional buttons to move the spaceship towards the floating instruments. Be careful though, if you hit one of the floating shapes, you'll lose the last instrument collected. Oh, except for the first one. That one's safe. Now, the spiky balls, you see, make you go faster and you're invincible for a few seconds. This game is timed, so keep an eye on the clock. Well, I hope I've been of some help. <laughs> Good luck!
Watch out, you're nearly out of power. Fly carefully. Try to find a pot of magic paint to give you more energy. Try not to fly into the buildings or trees. You'll lose a lot of magic paint if you bump into too many buildings. The further away you get, the paler the ring. Try to colour in all the objects. You have to colour in all the black and white objects shown at the top of your screen. To find these, use the ring that surrounds your tweeny. As you get closer to your object, it'll appear and then get brighter. Watch out for the power bar that shows you how much magic paint you've got. When you've run out, it's game over. Oh, and you can top up by using the magic paint pots. <laughs> Pressing a button on the controller makes your tweeny dance. <laughs> the display at the bottom of the screen tells you which button to press. Try to press the same buttons as the ones you see on the screen. Keep an eye on the screen to see which buttons you have to press. Try and collect all the stars. Groovy! You're doing great! Keep it up! Just press any of the four controller buttons at any time to make the tweeny dance. That's all you need to do at this difficulty level. <laughs> Have fun! Collect as many stars as you can by making your tweeny dance with the same moves as Fizz or Bella. Carefully watch and repeat the button sequences that appear on your screen. You have until the music finishes to collect the final big star. Well, <laughs> good luck and have fun! I've made. Use the left and right directional buttons to highlight a tweeny. Press the cross button to choose a tweeny. You have to decide which tweeny you want to play with. You're just seconds away from a world of fun. <laughs> Are you ready to play? I like adventures. Woof, 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 <laughs> What cool music I've made! Music. 